just realized that I'm a woman alone at night walking in a city, I don't know, in a park and I'm not scared in the slightest like I feel so safe and that's surely not something you could say about every city in the world I think that this area is my favorite part of Bergen and now I'm going to look for a cool place where I can have lunch maybe the one where I bought the carrot cake last night because it looked cool and cozy this is the big bang, the crack. and I also want to go up there and explore that area because the houses look beautiful this is the music that made the whole world turn The love that we all came from into which we now return I need to stop stopping every two seconds to take videos, but it's too beautiful. Travel far, followed all the stars and the sun. Someone lost their balloon. It's so heartbreaking when you lose a balloon. Imagine how beautiful this must be in summer, like having dinner here with your friends. Go band together and we sing. This is the big bang the Doesn't the logo of the Norwegian post office look like the Pokemon ball? Yes, I'm a 90s kid. I'm not used to cars stopping immediately as soon as they see you next to the crossing and so the poor drivers need to wait for me to realize that they're letting me go It's amazing, thanks Norwegian drivers, so kind This is the big bang, the cracking of the core This is the core that made the first um, super funny Italian movie was filmed here and one of the scenes was filmed just in that greenhouse there and I looked up the locations today out of curiosity because actually that's the reason why I came to Bergen I was influenced by that movie and it's so funny unfortunately it hasn't been translated into English but yeah, today I found out on the internet that one of the scenes from that movie was actually filmed around the corner from the hotel. What a coincidence. Hi everyone, you're standing on the kettle. You know in Naples you were standing on the microwave, now in Bergen you're standing on the kettle and who knows where you'll be standing in the next destination which kind of domestic appliance anyway i'm in my postcard writing position today i bought postcards so at first i bought these ones actually there weren't many that i liked oops i only liked this and this so i bought two of them but then i went 
to that shop that I took some videos of from outside and I knew that I would love that shop. As a matter of fact, I found these postcards which I find even more beautiful. So I bought two for my family, even though I should have bought one for myself as well, because I just love how like you get the atmosphere of the walk that I went on today in the residential area of Bergen with all the beautiful houses. And as usual, I didn't bring a pen. So I'm using pens that I bought as souvenirs. I'll do like beauty vloggers. Does it work? No, you can tell that I'm not a beauty blogger, but I'm a travel, not blogger, vlogger, but I'm a travel vlogger anyway. I'm using pens from the Munch Museum to write them. I also bought this hair tie in the shop called Heim. I guess it means home in Norwegian, who knows. And tonight I'm having Indian. Looking forward to that. It's not far from the Japanese and Burmese that I went for last night and I've seen it from the outside and it looks really cozy and inviting so I'll be going there. Let's go! It's raining and I don't have an umbrella but this jacket is amazing. This is the shop I like. Look at this lamp. Anyway, uh, yeah, this jacket is amazing. So even if I didn't bring gloves, a hat and a scarf, I don't actually need them because it's amazing. And two British ladies this morning even stopped me to compliment me on the jacket. <laughs> it's actually a kid's model. Ready to fly. I want a house here. Tomorrow morning they collect old kids' houses. I just realized that I'm a woman alone at night walking in a city, I don't know, in a park and I'm not scared in the slightest like I feel so safe and that's surely not something you could say about every city in the world so yeah I recommend Bergen to women traveling alone well I'm not in the hotel yet but no Honestly, I feel safe, very. I'm thinking that I could rent an electric scooter, but I wouldn't even know which part of the road to drive on. I'm all confused now, living in Scotland, so yeah, I'd better walk. And anyway, I realize that I'm so used to Scotland now and to the rain that it didn't even stop me from having a walk after dinner, you know? But now it's raining a lot and I would like to be in the hotel already, but I've got 15 minutes to walk still. The sea looks incredibly flat, very velvety. I just realized it must be nice to go up there and I read something about that and they told me that it's very nice, so I will go.
light is fading fast from this old town. We gotta go. Our bags are packed, so what are we waiting for? There's no point in delaying what we both already know. Escape this town with me. Freya, Freya. This is not bad. It actually looks nicer than my hotel room. <laughs> it surely has more space than my hotel room. Escape this time 